Welcome back to my channel Long Movie Short. Today I am explaining Movie Boyka, undisputed released in 2016. In Kyiv, Ukraine, lives an MMA fighter named Yuri Boyka. One evening, Boyka is fighting in an illegal match held in an underground arena. After a brief one-sided fight, he kicks the opponent in midair and knocks him out. The scene changes to a maximum security prison in Russia, the inmates participate in fights for the guards and the warden's entertainment, the deadliest prisoner of all time is a beast of a man named Koshmer. He is so aggressive that the guards have to chain his limbs and close his mouth to ensure he won't hurt anyone outside the ring. Koshmer's opponent is half his size and can hardly land a punch on him, he slams the man to the ground, breaking his neck before proceeding to punch him in the face. In the afternoon, Boyka is approached by his manager congrats him that he can compete legally in a European fighting tournament happening in Budapest. Then comes the day of the qualification match an opponent is a Russian man named Victor. The match begins and Boyka lands the first effective kick. It is easier for Boyka to make an attack and knocks Victor out with a knee to his jaw. By now, Boyka is frustrated so he lands a third punch on Victor's face, knocking him senseless. After the win, the manager gives Boyka a bundle of money asking him to train hard for the next match in two weeks. While leaving, Boyka sees that Victor is in a critical condition. The very next morning, he is told that Victor died last night in the hospital. Boyka asked about Victor's family, and the manager gives a letter from Victor's wife and their picture together. Boyka tells the manager about his wish to go to Russia but then he is refused he is so close to being a legitimate MMA fighter, but Boyka made his decision. We see Victor's wife Alma at Victor's funeral. She and Victor are indebted to a crime boss named Zurab, who suggests Alma be his mistress to pay off her debt. Alma replies that she will pay him in by working in his club soon. On arriving in Russia, Boyka goes to meet her and finds she works as a waitress in Zurab's underground fighting club. Boyka goes to the fight club and talks to her, Zurab's people stop him and escort him outside. Boyka asks them what time she will get off work. The gangsters attack him at the question but are in turn taught a lesson for messing with a professional fighter. Zurab sees Boyka fight and is impressed by his skills. He has been needing a fighter in his club and wants to hire Boyka. However, the man argues that he is not here to participate in fights, he simply wants to meet the girl. Zurab offers to talk to Alma on his behalf, but Boyka yet again disagrees with him and walks away. Boyka manages to sneak into the community center and meet Alma, gives her Victor's letter, and asks her if she is being forced to work at the fight club. Alma replies that she is bound by the debt. She then asks him if he saw her husband's last fight. Boyka comes clean, admitting that he was the last person Victor fought. He tries explaining that the death was an accident but Alma refuses to listen to her husband's killer. Boyka goes to Zurab and agrees to fight on the condition to forget all of Alma's debt. The deal is that Boyka has to win three matches against the opponent of Zurab's choice. The gangster also promises to keep him safe from the police and authorities since he knows he got to Russia using a fake passport. He goes to a local gym to train for the matches but is bullied by a man. Boyka slams him down with a single kick. The day of the first fight. Boyka goes against a local fighter who manages to land a few weak kicks but is proven to be weak in front of someone as good as Boyka. He manages to knock him down and is about to kill him but the opponent accepts defeat. After the fight, Boyka asks Alma if she knows a good local gym. Alma invites him to use the gym in her community center. He trains there for the next few days and ultimately, Alma got easy with him. Boyka's next match is a two versus one against a pair of brothers. He is surprised but Zurab told him that it is his arena and his rules. Still, he manages to push one away and knock the other one down in the seconds they take to recover. After that, he kicks both their asses and scores a double knockout. Upon reaching his room, he finds Alma waiting for him. She urges him to tell the truth about her husband's death and Boyka starts telling her the match against Victor was his only chance at getting a better life. He knows that accepting his help is very difficult for Alma but he begs her to let him do what he has to. At night, for the final match, Boyka goes against Igor, Zurab's best fighter who had been mocking Boyka since the day he arrived. He beats Igor in black and blue, making him bleed profusely until he passes out. With this, he wins the entire tournament, and Alma's debt is paid. However, Zurab reveals that he has to fight one last man for their deal to be over. He gets ready to fight the final champion Koshmer. He is brought into the arena in chains. The fight starts but Boyka is already too tired. 
The beast lands several punches on him before kicking him in the jaw. Boyka falls down because of the impact and has a hard time standing back up. Boyka takes him by surprise and pushes him back with a kick. He holds the beast in an arm lock, breaking his right arm before kicking him out of the ring. With his wins, Zurab makes his minion attack Boyka and tries to run away with the girl. Boyka attacks the guards and kills them all. Zurab shot Boyka, but Boyka caught him and strangled him to death. Alma tries to help Boyka and he asks for her forgiveness. In a few moments, the police arrive and arrest him and pulled him away before a reply. In a Russian prison, Alma comes to visit him and tells him that he is forgiven. Boyka is relieved for the first time in months even though his plan to become a professional fighter failed. In the last scene, we see him fighting in the prison's arena, continuing to hold the title of the Undisputed. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, and press the bell icon for more new videos on our channel.